Hi, so for many online teachers, we need to share our screen and share materials such as um, PDFs, PowerPoints, digital books, games, and so on. But what about when you don't need to share any materials? Well, I like to share a web page called Classroom Screen, um, as it has some useful but basic teaching tools. Um, and I'm going to show you some of the tools uh, now. Okay, first of all, I'm going to change the language. Um, I'm going to change it to English. Uh, and as you can see straight away, uh, the, the tools um, look very basic, um, but they, are, can, they can be quite useful. Um, first of all, I'm going to change the background as well. Um, something a bit more interesting and related to maybe England as well. You can select solid backgrounds here. You can have a shuffle on if you wish. Uh, and maybe upload your own, which I haven't done yet. Um, you can have GIFs. They do take, sometimes take quite a long time to load up if you've just used the GIF for the first time. Uh, I've used the bonfire scene before, so that does load up quite quickly. Uh, but I'm going to choose my regular London Bridge. Um, the dynamic ones are great for young learners. Uh, it's quite captivating, really. Um, I've had a group where they just will look at that and they are quite silent, uh, which is which is great. Um, so that has, that has been quite helpful. Uh, another helpful tool I use is the clock. Um, and another one would be the timer and the drawing and text tools and the random name. Um, the clock is just a basic clock. Uh, you can change it to a calendar. Or if you click the plus one icon here, you'll get now the calendar as well as a separate icon. Um, I use I use the the calendar, uh, obviously to tell them the, what day it is and stuff like that. Uh, if I'm setting homework for the future or like a due date, I can use the actual calendar, um, which is easier for them to actually understand and see. Uh, I can minimize these now. There you go. The timer I always use when, when, when I'm setting a time. If they're not using any materials uh, or their own materials, for example, in their house, um, then I can set a timer on this on here and then share this screen. Uh, maybe they're doing a speaking activity for one minute. I can set my timer. There are some, when it reaches obviously zero, uh, there are some annoying sounds I suppose uh, but it's good to grab their attention when it's finished there are some funny ones like the mushroom one I think it's Super Mario. I've had a few laughs from that one as well um, there is also a stopwatch here I don't really use that um, the traffic lights I've used it before obviously they tell my Teenagers use it when to stop work. The, te the teenagers respond obviously better than let's say primary level. Uh, the primary level kids will just continue uh, doing what they want, obviously. Uh, but that, I think the, the young, the like level, um, maybe like 13 year olds uh, do respond quite well and they will get ready to begin work. They will stop and they will go, yeah. Uh, but it's just training them really. Uh, they do respond quite well to that. Um, and the text, obviously it's just a text box. You can enlarge it, um, move it on the screen as well, write what you need to write. Um, very, very basic. Hello. Uh, the drawing tool as well, I've sometimes used as well. Let's have a see, black, yeah. Uh, yeah, very, very basic. Another one I use is random name. Uh, just write in their names, uh, Tim, Tom, Terry, and it will choose their name randomly, uh, which has been very useful. Uh, when the kids are screaming, can I go first, sir? Obviously, I'll just do this quickly. Um, and that 
that's it. There's also dice as well on here, um, which you can use. It's very useful. Um, and that's it. Nothing too complicated. Uh, they, you know, they have. They are quite useful when I just share this screen. Uh, when I'm not sharing any PDFs or PowerPoints, I can come back to this screen. For example, if I'm doing a, a game or something, or one of my um, digital books, I can obviously skip to this screen straight away. And the screen's still sharing, and I can obviously use my traffic lights, set a time, or um, you know, let's uh, check the time. But yeah, that's it. I hope this has uh, helped uh, and maybe it can be useful in your class.